Vice Chair of the Vito Marcantonio Forum. I am the Vice Chair of Melissa's Mark Viverito's fan club. And I knew her a long time ago. You know, when? I knew her when. And she's a great hero and follows in the footsteps of the great Vito Marcantonio. Melissa, please talk. Thank you, Gerald. I wanted. To, I just wanted to come by and, and lend support. I, I did last year when you did that wonderful event uh, in the cemetery, and this is just a great way of really remembering an incredible individual, uh, someone that I think uh, too often people don't know enough about, and there are those that we still have to educate about the legacy and the importance of Vito Marcantonio and what he means to the community. Lulu Lolo, nice to see you. Um, so I just wanted to come by. This is great uh, in terms of retracing the steps and the important areas of significance to Vito's life, but obviously uh, as a Puerto Rican and as a progressive, you know, the, the real affinity that he had of representing true progressive issues, but also the alliances and collaboration and solidarity that he built with the Puerto Rican people, right? And the community right. and also the island and its, its uh, challenges that we continue to have today. But uh, a voice for disadvantaged individuals, uh, really fought hard uh, on behalf of many issues that we still care about here today, right? In terms of living wage, in terms of immigrants, et cetera, and empowerment in general. So uh, it's really great. I feel really uh, proud to represent a district that was represented by Vitor Mar Marcantonio. And so thank you for all of those, uh, the forum and all of those that continue his, uh, his work, right? Reminding people of the legacy and, and what he me means, not only to this community, but to the city of New York and to this country. So thank you, and I I'm really happy to be here with all of you. Melissa, thank you. Melissa. You know how it is, that, you know, you have this position now, so everybody's tugging on you. I have somebody, he needs to get an apartment. You know, you know how it goes. So we're together here, and um, I would like to ask you that we could meet. We have this informal executive committee. We think we're very important. We're meeting, we're talking, we're, you know, whatever. And we would like to say, to meet with you, that to reestablish the great tradition of the Lucky Corner, where the progressive political leaders running for office on election eve came here and they came here to uh east 116th street and lexington avenue because it was the crossroads of east harlem but it also was this type of boundary in a way between the big italian community and the jewish community and the puerto rican community but everybody came to the lucky corner and all the progressive people from brooklyn from the bronx came here and there was a massive rally and we need that, we need that. We need to feel the strength of each other. So I hope we can reestablish the tradition of the lucky corner where us progressive people get together and fight for the election of wonderful progressive people like yourself. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you very much. I think we should go 